So, uh, we're going to make a little comparison here on a full HD screen, Asus MX279H and Asus 4K monitor PQ321QE. And the first thing I noticed when using this enormous resolution was how much space I actually have on my desktop. Uh, over here I can fit a little bit over 1000 shortcuts and uh, hopefully this will be more than enough for most of you and if you're trying to look or find something in specific here it will actually be quite hard. Looking at the browser here I'm uh, browsing into The Verge and I can see that I have basically all the top news uh, on my screen without having to scroll down and actually that feels quite nice. What's even more interesting to see is if we compare the window that we have here in the browser on the 4K monitor and dragging this over to the full HD screen you can see that while only taking up a fraction of the screen here on the 4K it will take up almost all of the space on the full HD screen monitor so it's an enormous difference in how much you can actually use on your desktop Another interesting aspect that I think a lot of people are interested in is to see how well it performs in games and actually how much is required from your hardware. The computer we're using here uses a GTX 680 graphics card with 2GB of VRAM. So while starting the game here I'm using medium uh, settings in Battlefield 3 and well of course it looks really really good. The details is quite amazing and while playing it does actually run quite smoothly uh, we get a little over 50 frames per second here while playing and it, of course it's using the 4k resolution uh, if you're going to play in higher details like for instance if you want to play with ultra then you will most likely need a little bit more vram than the gtx 680 features so i would recommend maybe three gigabytes or more but this runs really nice actually.